2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. And thanks for joining us on this Christmas. Well, Kevin and Guy. Thanks, David. A lot of teams with a lot of new players, Greg, this time of year can be a real challenge to mesh. No doubt. You know, getting everybody on the same page sometimes, it, it, it can take time. And then you have to build that trust. Weathering the storms together will obviously help you do that. Now the starting group for the visitors. G out there with Edwards. And it's Rain Man. Then it's Q. And it's Crawford at the shooting guard. We've got Irving. Big Dog is out there with Zion Williamson. Then it's Jones. And it's Moore in at the small forward. That free throw missing. And he sinks the second. Here's Graham. Passes it to Roy. He kicks it to Edwards. Here is Jeffries. Graham. He can't get it to go. Some solid defense there from Irving. And it goes out of bounds. Uh, last touch by Irving. Jeffries, the pass to Crawford. And there's the call on Jones. That's his first foul. Edwards with it. The basket is good off the assist from Graham. And here's Irving. The pass to Big Dog. Moore outside. The tray got a piece of it. Here's the break. Here's Jeffries. That one's off. He starts the game with a miss. Williamson left side. And finished off Gray Williamson. Yeah, so fun to watch him get fancy on any finish. Zion again to the rack. Gone one of three for the field to start this one so far. Graham surveying the floor. Here's Roy, and he lays it straight in. Uncovered at the rim, finding cracks in the defense here early on. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. What elevation. He's a smaller but still determined big man, and he likes mixing it up with his impressive vert. Crawford, no one around him. Off target with his three. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. And the dunk by Williamson. Yeah, I dare a man to take the charge on Tyon Williamson. Everybody getting out of the way. Now here's Graham. There's 154 left here in the opening quarter. Lock at six. Moore with the steal. And here we go. Fast break. Williamson's got it. And the dunk by Williamson. So great to see Zion Williamson out on the wing and coming down the lane. That's a guy hard to stop on a fast break. Now Crawford. Uncovered. Rebounded by Moore. Great offensive performance they're putting on. And guys, we call that the zone because that's where they are right now. They are in a zone, and I'm sure they feel unstoppable. And some pinball action out there as defenders just bouncing off of Williamson on that play. Now here's Crawford down low. It's stolen by Jones. Here's Irving. Good, and the assist goes to Williamson. Kyrie not backing away from the contact there. In fact, welcoming that one, tricked you into it. 
and they're allowing too many points in the paint. Coach is going to let them hear about it. Yeah, coach knows that. They know that. In the timeout, they're going to hear about it, make the adjustment. And a chance now to see how teams are faring across the league. Here's the latest edition of the Power Rankings. They ascend up the list to number three with some spirited play. Well, right now for this home ball club, they believe they can be more competitive than they've shown. It's still very early in the season, so the optimism for a successful run is still there. And that was another look at the aggressive D that led to the mobile one block. And early in the game, a defensive play like that goes a long way, establishing the attitude you want. Now, here's Marshall. And the defense not making things easy for them. No good, unable to end this run. Here's Williamson. Off target there, that would have pushed the lead to double digits. Graham with the ball, guarded now by Irvin. Gonna go. He misses the first attempt on the night. Gone six of eight in the game so far. A very solid start for them. That's his second shot and his second basket. He's two for two. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. And a wide open look for Freak. Good on the triple. Two teammates connecting right there. Slick feed. Seven seconds left to play in the first. Here's Irving. Buried from 15 feet out. Irving's got six. Yeah, I feel like he uses the dribble to set up his rhythm for the mid-range shots like that one. Kyrie knocks another in. And we reach the end of the first quarter. Up by nine. And back with the start of the second quarter in just a moment. through one quarter. It's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. Guys, what's your take on the home team so far? Yeah, in that first period, they looked to push in transition at every opportunity. It felt like they knew that there were openings in transition and just wanted to keep trying to feed that, get out quick. Rager, the all-time assist leader for the Big West Conference. In that frame, talk about some of the traits that make for a, for a good Origin, a good point guard, a good facility. Yeah, I mean, listen, you, you have to be a leader because that's what the position calls for. Uh, unselfishness, instincts, that stuff matters. But ultimately, your, your teammates got to feel like you play for them. Uh, and, and that's when you have a team, a chance as a team to, to be special. I'm assuming you've always been like that. Am I correct? No, that oh, is not really? true. Wow. I evolved into a leader in all seriousness wow. you know you, I think it, some guys are natural what a wow. fans loving that right there what a nice. it's just so agile is Zion out there and those kind of plays gutting through the defense and just finding lanes to rip through here is Wilcox most coaches will tell you, you need scoring in the paint to be successful. Here are some big men around the league that have been providing plenty of that over the last month. Zion Williamson on top. He is so polished offensively in the low post. I mean, even when the defense collapses, he's got guys all around, and he finds a way to put the ball in the basket. Yeah, in this quarter, they've had the right approach, driving and drawing, initiating contact, create opportunities, get to the line. Rebound by Marshall. To the paint and stolen by Irving. And they're pushing it up. Goes up and the dunk by Williamson. And here we go. This is great stuff as Zion looks like he's about to take over the game. Williamson's gone a terrific six of eight shooting from the floor. Graham, the pass to McKnight. Now 
Marshall over Williamson. Off the iron that time. And if that's the best look you can get on a possession, what a waste of a trip down the floor. Yeah, see the coach? He's got that frown on his face. I think we know why. Not a high percentage look. The visitors with the ball. Down by 15. And in their two matchups last season, they came up empty both times. Not really too shocking when you see how they fared overall. We're about a minute and a half into the second quarter now. Graham, the pass to Marshall. The basket is good off the assist from Graham. Graham's got three assists tonight. Of all the action happening there, it's the assist that jumps out to me there. That's just a great look and a great setup for the bucket. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that. That's your only option. Zion's part of a very exclusive club, a player who comes into the league as a clear number one pick. A lot of responsibilities on his shoulder to turn the franchise around to a consistent championship caliber competitor. Mavericks checked in for Marshall. Can't talk enough about the subtleties in that setup right there. The assist really the key to that entire sequence. I'm sorry. That's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. Gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Now here's Freak defended by Jones on the wing mirror. Plenty of space. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. Gone five of six so far from the field in the second quarter. Inside, Irving. Ramsey with the rebound. Being a lackluster, 38% for the game, struggling so far. Graham, the pass to Ramsey. Power down with both hands. And that's a little lack of fight at the defensive end. Uh, absolutely. At least on that slam, you're right. That's one way to let a team back in the game. You have to credit the aggressiveness offensively because that's when you make a play when you really need it. Getting a scorching 68% in the game. Marion with the steal. Here's Graham, and Graham throws it down. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. And the gamble paying off. Irving can't hit. Gone four of seven from the field in this second quarter so far. Here's Marion. And Jones pulls it down. And very well, 56% from the floor here in the second quarter. And it's more penetrating. Yeah, put some students in the classroom because that's exactly how you move the ball. Kyrie terrific at spotting the open man. And then you got to get it to him. We've got 28 seconds left to play here in the half. The shot by Marion, no good. Well, if he's going to keep shooting, they've got to run some plays for him. Screens, pick and rolls, anything they can do to get him started. And there's the call on Joe. That's foul number two for him. 44% from the floor since we began the second quarter. Bring him against Irving. And he can't get the first one. And he's good on the second. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And we could get used to seeing a lot of highlights just like that. Zion's power and body control leading the points. He's 0 of 2 at the line in this one. Six seconds left to play in the first half. Graham from outside. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for him. Zion. And so it's the home team. 13 points up at the end of the period. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. Zion Williamson was on fire in the first half. He ended up with... Thanks for joining us. Yeah. 
And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. You look at Zion Williamson, guys. In this game, he has been everywhere. Yeah, pretty much all throughout that first half. And he was taking care of his business on the low blocks and getting more than his fair share of dunks. Yeah, there's not any guy defensively that was bodying him up or contesting the shot. So right now he's feasting. They've got Zion Williamson. Jones is out there with Irving. Then there's baddest one, and it's Big Dog in at the five down low. So that's who James Borrego starts the second half with. Here's Crawford. And no good. But close in that one, so he'll shoot two. Great talkers over the years, trash talkers on the floor in this league. You think they do it more to get themselves going, Greg, or do they do it with the purpose of getting under their opponent's skin? And Kevin, that's a, a great question. And believe it or not, you see both. I've seen guys who do it to get under your skin, but I've also seen guys that do it for their own benefit. That's how they derive their confidence. And so uh, it's about you figuring out what works for you. I've seen some guys, they don't say smack. They don't, they don't say a word during the course of the game, but they will cut your heart out. So it's just about what fits your personality in terms of making you play your best. Well, I'm glad you don't trash talk here on 2K, Greg. I'll tell you that right now. No, we don't do that. <laughs> here is Jeffries, defended by Jones. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Rain Man. That is his first foul of the game. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And when you're behind in the game, that's what you've got to do. Contest every shot. And if you're just joining us, we play it over a minute here in the third. Irving for three. They grab their own miss. That one goes. Count it. Williamson's got 17. Yeah, Zion's going to bring that to the table right there. A presence on the boards and determined to score once he gets his hands on that rock. He just punched the ticket on that one. That'll get the job done. Powerful two and jam. On its way from Irving for two. That one off the back iron and out. Pass to Croft. And there's the call on Joe. That'll be his third foul so far. Greg, the NBA under Adam Silk has been aggressive looking for ways to enhance the product and attract fans. Where do you fall on that point? Push the envelope or don't rock the boat or maybe somewhere in between? I think it might be somewhere in between. These days, people's attentions can be pulled in so many different directions. I think they're smart to not rest on their laurels and, and to continue to try to evolve, but with that evolution, sometimes it's not going to come over as well as they would like. But I, I'm a fan of some of the experiments, I should say, that we've tried thus far. And I hope the league continues to push the envelope. That's a good thought. Gone three of three from the field since halftime. To the middle. Here's Marshall. And a missed late. Gone two of seven from the field in the third. That leaves room for improvements here. Yep, that one goes. Williamson's got 19 points. And at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could have hoped for today. They get a hand on it. Jones with it. Guarded now by Marshall. Let's go. It's hauled in by Edwards. Being 43% from the field. To the wing right side. Jefferson inside, defended by Jones. Williamson against Crawford. That's good for Williamson on the assist by Irving. Irving's got six assists here tonight. Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. And Jones over to help. Meyer passes to Jeffers. Trains it from beyond the arc. Jeffries got his first three points of the game. That's pretty much not how they want to defend the three-point line. Somebody's got to shadow him out there. And that one's good, Irving. Yeah, three consecutive field goals have come right at the rim. The D had better start buckling now. As to Edwards. 
Here's Little General. He's covered by Irving. Here's Meyer. Can't hit from 12. Gone just a bit under 50% from the field since halftime. Five out of 11. Here's Williamson. Good. Williamson's got eight here in the quarter. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. And there's the call on Zion Williamson. That's his third foul of the game. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Here's Little General. He's covered by Irving. And he makes the first. Both good from the line that time. Wow, they've made every free throw here in the second half. Williamson looking it over. And finished off by Williamson. Yeah, he's too good athletically. If Zion gets that close, that is big trouble. Marion outside. Fires from deep. A three-pointer is right on target. And so it's the home team holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. Their shooting has been the big key. Their percentage from the field so far has been terrific. And we'll be back with you shortly. been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. Being here about 46% for the game. Rain Man is out there with Maverick and it's Cowboy then it's Q and it's Wilcox in at the two. An offensive execution has been beyond great there. 63% from the floor in this game. Kick out to Moore. Flying his work from deep. No good on that one. Not great numbers, but great effort in this one. Sounds funny, but I think he's been a positive for them. Passes it to Graham. To the inside. Good on the shot, and that shaved the lead to single digits. Six points for Rain Man. Yeah, the D has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the court. Total letdown by the D. Can't leave the bucket unprotected. Absolutely. And it attacks an easy two points onto the lead. Will not find a higher percentage opportunity than that. And it's Big Dog with the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. To the right side. Here's Ramsey. Rebounded by Moore. One item that stood out, their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking. And more importantly, it makes it really hard to defend. And that one's good, Williamson. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. Gone one of three from the field to start the fourth quarter. Here's Roy, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. Greg, you were drafted 12th overall by the New York Knicks, and then second overall by the Grizzlies in the expansion trip. So you've had a very unique view of being in that position in two different settings. Yeah, I mean, two very different cities, but really each beautiful in its own way. Uh, the, the New York draft, obviously coming out of college, that was like a dream come true to go and play for Pat Riley and, and then get the opportunity to go and be a part of a brand new team in a new country, if you will, was also uh, a, a really cool experience as well. I hope we can take a petition started by you and me to get the end NBA back in Vancouver. I and going Seattle, to Vancouver. right? Let's get back oh, in both Seattle. those cities. Exactly. Exactly. And the one hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hand and he's the one doing the slam. Agreed. He is smooth as silk, even on a power finish. 
Here's Graham. And then Roy with the jam. And just scrapes and claws for that offensive rebound and, and doesn't take any chances there with the put. PGA strong work all around. And the mm -hmm. rebound and the stuff both. Wow. Gone three of six in the field so far in the fourth quarter. It's Roy on the wing. And the pass to Graham. Free throw line jump shot. He goes up again. And it's laid in by Roy. Roy's got 10 points in just the second half. The hard work on the offensive glass. You can see the coaching staff rise up and clap for that effort. Here's Williamson. Banked in off the glass. Well, a little contact from the defense goes a long way for Zion Williamson. And so Steve Kerr decides to call a timeout. Let's present our New Balance player of the game, Zion Williamson. And guys, no doubt who our pick was going to be. Uh, he's made everyone else on the court look like they're playing at half speed. It's been total domination, and you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. He doesn't take over games like this very much, but it's always possible. And when he does here at home, these fans love it. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Hey, guys, I was able to catch the message Steve Kerr gave to his team. He told his guys, this is it. We need one final push here. Everyone working together. Let's go get these guys. He also talked about making smart plays with the ball. Kevin, you can't have any mistakes at this point of the game. And the dunk by Williamson. Excellent on both ends of that play. Yeah, the steal was sharp, but the slam topped it off. And we say it time and time again, so I'll repeat it. Have to be careful with the ball, or this is what happens. He took the opportunity when he saw it. He's gone six of nine on their field goal attempt since the start of the fourth quarter. And finished off Frank Williamson. And once they smelled blood in the water, you could see the killer instinct take over. Yeah, up until that point, a competitive game. But once they broke through that barrier, it was all them. Complete control. Poked away. It's stolen by Jones. And here we go. Williamson heading to the hoop. And the shot goes in. This arena was rocking throughout the night. You, you could really feel the energy. Yeah, huge motivation. Always great for a young team, but... Veteran players also appreciate when fans come with that kind of energy and get into the spirit of the game. Meyer, and there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Well, at this point, they're just trying to get back and see. You, you want to play a good brand of basketball. Consistency definitely is a, a key to some of the playoff performing teams, and tonight they just did not find it in this contest. About three seconds between shot and game clock. And there's the call on Zion Williamson. That will be foul number five on him. We've got 22 seconds left to play here in the fourth. You know what? Tried to step in and cut him off. It just didn't get there quick enough. And the first one drops. And so Cunningham nails both of them. 17 seconds left in the game. Here's Williamson. And it's AI with the rebound. Here is Cunningham. From the arc. The shot, no good. And so the home crowd treated to a win. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home tonight. And it makes a big difference. And once they started to really play in rhythm, you never felt like they had any doubts as to whether or not they were going to win. And that about wraps it up for Greg Anthony, Brett Berry, and David Aldrich. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. See you next time.